Yo, what's the word? It's your boy 16. If you like the content on this channel, I want to ask you to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to click that bell for post notifications. Also, I got a website at www.16shotonvisuals.com. But that's enough of me talking. Let's get to what y'all came to see. So, yeah. So, what's your feelings on, like, someone having that in their past and being, like, a street dude in the future? Oh, uh, so what do we say? Okay, nigga, I, I used to pimp. I can't change. I I used to rob. I used to break in the houses. I done shot it. I done shot up some shit. I done shot at white folks. I done done some shit in my past, homie. So the things that I did at 17, I can't grow from. The things that I done at 23 when I was a damn fool, I can't grow from. So what y'all telling us is we got to be retarded. That's what the word retard means. No, but that ain't growing though, going from... Oh, well, if I go out to, uh, if I go from street lifestyle to law abiding no, lifestyle, that's growing. That's growing. The other way around, though. If you go from law abiding to street, well, because I, I don't, I'm not really too familiar about dude. I don't know too much about. Well, him, but that's well, what I th this what we forget, homie. Rappers aren't street. I don't give a fuck how gangster their lyrics are. Their lyrics are supposed to be gangster. But the rapper is not supposed to be gangster. When you see Stone Cold Steve Austin in the ring wrestling, when you meet Stone Cold Steve Austin, that ain't the wrestler. He a different person in real life. The rapper life is not supposed to align with the lyrics. I don't know who taught us that. Tupac wasn't no gangster, but he rapped gangster like a motherfucker. Ice Cube wasn't no gangster, but they rapped gangster like a motherfucker. Dr. Dre wasn't no gangster, but rap gangster like a motherfucker. All these niggas rap gang, but they're not gangsters. So now this new generation saying because Pop Hunter's never been gangster, he can rap gangster because he's never been gangster. He ain't living gangster. You see what I'm saying? Now you can rap gangster, kill a nigga this, and then when you get through rapping out the studio, you take off your costume. You get out of character. See, the rappers aren't getting out of character. They bringing the character, they rap character, home with them. So they at the house with the kids. You, they don't never turn into daddy. <laughs> they don't never turn into, hey, son, give me a hug, son. They don't never turn into, hey, Big Chris. We didn't even know they called Biggie Smalls Big Chris before he became Notorious Big. He was Big Chris. So we don't never get to know the person because we think Pop Hunter got to be gangster. No, nah, homie, he can rap like this because that's what we like to listen to. And then when he come off video, he can be a good kid again. It's okay. So are you uh you you basically comfortable with like your rappers not being what they portray to be? In yes, I would much rather. We need we need characters. We need uh Superman ain't really Superman. Uh Shrek ain't really Shrek. We let the kids watch Shrek. The nigga who the motherfucking taught it play Toy Story. Ain't really tar story. So yeah, we need them niggas. Just like we need the wrestling characters. The we need the football characters. Nigga, we love Bruce Lee. But Bruce Lee can't whoop a hundred niggas. <laughs> so nah, homie, we need them niggas to not be really as gangster as they rapping about. Cause none of them really are anyway. I mean, I think sometime like if a rapper come out right now and be like, all oh, that shit I rap about false, this career done that over with. Like, well, that's cause we, society, well, society. that's cause we that's cause we fake. We want that nigga to be fake. We want that nigga to be real. We want that nigga to throw his life away for then us. Then they do, we call him stupid. <laughs> like, <laughs> then we do, we call him stupid. So uh we get mad at a rapper cause he don't write his own lyrics. Man, ain't nothing wrong with that. <laughs> nigga. Easy E never wrote his lyrics. Ice Cube wrote all the lyrics. They still it's, a legend. Yeah, it's okay, homie. For you niggas to come out and say, hey, homie, I ain't never shot up nobody. How Tupac talked about rapping and selling dope, moving keys, and came out and said, man, I couldn't sell dope. I didn't know how to sell dope. <laughs> Tupac talked about killing. He ain't never killed nobody. All the rappers talking about killing. They talk about body for body, murder for murder, and they got homeboys who done been killed and they ain't done nothing. You see what I'm saying? So they they do rap about shit that they don't do. Yeah. They talk about, they go rent, they go put cars in their videos that they don't really have. When they go on the road and they driving around, nigga, they rent and lease cars that they don't have. 
Nigga, they tell us that the jewelry on their neck costs, they got a, a $100,000 chain. And they want us to believe they paid a $100,000 for that chain. They want us to believe that. Mm -hmm. They want us to believe they walking around with $2.5 million worth of jewelry. They want us to believe that, huh? So they already lying to us. So they might well just come on out and say, hey, y'all, we man, I don't do none of this shit. <laughs> So like, what's your uh, overall like beef with rappers? Cause I noticed you you be calling them. Yeah, a they they lie, yeah. homie. They don't tell the whole truth. They ain't told us one story about how bad lockdown is. A rapper about jail, prison. They ain't told us what about lockdown. They ain't gave us no stories about who get raped, how they rape you. The hood. Sometimes the hood rape you. Sometimes you go in there as a nigga repping the hood, but you really ain't a strong nigga in the hood rape you. They ain't telling that part. They ain't telling you about when you get to 20 years, his homie got 20 years and his mama died. He couldn't go to the funeral, but don't none of us go see by his sister. They ain't told us not one time when they killed uh, 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 King Von, how his home. Ain't nobody rapped about how his homeboys went and stole all this stuff and took all this stuff. There ain't nobody put that in the song. Tell us all the stuff, man. This don't give us the good part. Tell us all the stuff so the kids can make, so at least we can have some type of informed decision making when we listen to this shit. But right now it's glorified. It's, it's, it's propagated. It, it sounds good to kill your homeboy, run off on the plug. Nigga, why you gonna run off on the plug and this how we eat? Yeah. So man, they teaching wrong, homie. They ain't even no more song for the soul. These niggas really killing people in the neighborhood and then come rapping about it. And then when they come up dead, oh man, long live. Man, God had to let him die. God had to get him out of here for what he done done. He ain't repented. Nigga, you done kill all these people and shot up all these niggas mama's houses and then made all these mamas cry. You think you finna come rap about it and glorify this demonic shit and God ain't gonna bring pain to your mama and your people? You gotta reap what you sow, baby. And you think you finna sing about it and praise and dance for the devil and thank God ain't finna intercede? Come on, homie. So that's what we seeing. That's why we seeing rappers die and young niggas die because, nigga, they playing with death now. They singing about it. And they glorifying it. Nigga, we, that was taboo for us. Black folks ain't never been that demonic. But we sang it, but we had telling, telling we gonna smoke a dead nigga pack. So what we see now, we see the children of the corn, homie. So what I'm saying is, the rapper, they the new tool of white supremacy. They, they help fuel the prison system. And then, not only are they the tool of white supremacy, they the agent of darkness and Satan and the demonic forces in the devil's kingdom on earth. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing good about a rapper. Ain't nothing righteous about a rapper. Ain't nothing godly, no God spirit. Nigga, they don't give you one good song. So how I'm gonna go over there with them and all they rap about is kill nigga, nigga, kill me a nigga, kill his mama, kill his family, we a wife his family. They are my enemy as a black man that love the black woman, that love the black race, and love the nigga nation. They go wipe us out. So no, I hate that homie. They are a dark force of, of, of the devil. So I can't side with no demon force. Like I even seen before you had uh caught out little dirt for uh I guess moving the way he moved. Yeah. Like someone like him, what what you saying, like, you know, you, you don't really fuck a rapper shit like that. Would you be willing like to sit down and have a convo and like try to No, hell no. We'll talk to him for what and that white boy got that money in his ass. 